Motherfucker! Hi, Oddish. You're mine now. Oddish. God damn it, why were you facing the other way? <laughs> There's no way we're gonna catch up, I still want those points, god damn it. Fuck! Boy, I really regret going for this beam. <laughs> beam. The Lux is in here. Nano machine, son. Nano machine, son. When did this become Planet Side 2? <laughs> that was Metal Gear Rising, you fucking degenerate. <laughs> also, Senator Armstrong. Like, I don't know if anybody else shares this opinion with me, but Senator Armstrong was, like, just the best. Oh, absolutely. He He's on, like, yeah. fucking handsome Jack levels of over-the-top fucking <laughs> hammy villains. Like, <laughs> holy Jack. shit. I love him. Fucking the antagonist of Borderlands 2. Really funny motherfucker. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Terrifying. Oh, I know it's Jack. Dig. Yeah, Terrifyingly insane, stallion. but terrifyingly yeah. insane, but also a fucking ho uh, fucking terrifying threat to deal with. Hmm. Indeed. Hang on. Hang on. Let me. Let me. Let me see. And then the pre sequel came out and said, "Oh, by the way, this is why Jack is the way he is." And I find myself going, "Holy shit! He didn't deserve to go through any I of what he just went." I find myself conflicted. Mm. Fucking pre-sequel. I like. Yeah, you like the pre-sequel. While it wasn't that great of a game, it, it did really make you sit there and go, "Wow, I I, I feel bad for Jack." The thing yeah. I didn't like about <laughs> like, the pre it, it, it it shined him in a different light. So yeah, you just can't help but the pity him gotcha. now. Yeah, well, I know. If I had, if the game gave you the choice to like either work with Jack at the end or you know do what Go you on. normally do and kill him, I would have chosen to side with Jack. No, 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 no. Ah, there we go. What kept bothering me about ow. that game was how, the, like, most of the progression is you get stopped at something. Oh, you need to go kill a bunch of guys. Stop here. Go kill a bunch of guys. Like, that over and over and over again with the pre-sequel, and it got really old. I will pay you to kill yourself. I got a perfect spot all <laughs> picked out for you. You don't want to? That's fine. Call the Hyperion suicide line. You'll get nothing. But you want to get paid, you'll go, and you'll jump off of that cliff. <laughs> oh, boy. Cue somebody jumping off the cliff shouting, I'm going to be rich! <laughs> Even though you're going to be fucking like... dead. So, joke's on yeah. you. Doesn't he only give you, like, fucking $10 or some shit, or whatever the currency is in Pandora? Probably. Uh... No, he pays you, like, a fucking... He pays you, like, I think a couple thousand, because fucking... He's handsome, Jack. He's got money to spare. He will probably wipes his ass with Benjamins. Ew. Probably. He probably doesn't oh. even care about money since Iridium is the new hot shit in, in fucking Pandora. Okay. That little moment when, uh, <laughs> when somebody said, I'm gonna be rich! I could easily hear handsome Jack saying, Oh, you know what's up my mind? You'll be dead before you can get it. That's not a problem, is it? Oh, Hades. That sounds yeah. familiar. Hades. It's from Hades. Oh, yeah, from Hades. Hades. From Hercules. From Hercules. Yeah. Hey, Hercules. buddy, let's kill Handsome Jack and then we'll all go out for milkshakes. Nah, I'm just kidding. He's still really dead. <laughs> I don't know. The Tiny Tina expansion that for that. Line uh... gets... That line gets me every line. fucking time. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. He's still really dead. Ah, <laughs> uh, you gotta like the humor in the game. Oh, wait. But have you played the uh, Tiny Tina's uh, D and D dungeon thing that was? In yes, I played all the DLCs. That was like one of the only games I think that I actually played all the DLCs for because they were all so fucking good. Like. Hey. My least favorite was probably fucking 
Captain Ooh. Scarlet DLC just because it was be right really be fucking Scarlet. spread out. Like, oh. I, I get the concept of it, and it was kind of cool, but at the same time, it also made having the fucking hovercraft a requirement, and if you got fucking, if it got blown up, you were fucking stuck out there for a hot fucking minute. You'd have to fucking jog for easily, like, ten minutes to get back to where you could get another one. And that was, that just became a fucking drag. Okay, let's, let's see. I want Team Cherry to fucking release Silk Song already. Yeah, really. Ow! God what? Damn it. How did he shoot me through the wall? God damn. Carefully. There goes B. <laughs> yes. Oh. Okay. Oh, I was really worried that you would kill all those bandits before they could murder old Gran. But hey, okay. now they're dead, so I don't even have to pay him. So, uh, thanks for that, man. Uh, still gonna kill you, though. <laughs> uh. Handsome Jack just has the best. Fu he he he's easily probably the most quotable fucking video game villain there is. It's so, about, uh, it's so good. What about the uh, old guy from Portal Two? Cave Johnson. Yeah, Cave Johnson. Uh, I mean, he has one good quote. He, he's got a couple good quotes, but really, just Handsome Jack hands down. There we go. Well, Handsome yeah, Jack point. is also the inventor of Butt Stallion, which wasn't going to be a part of the game until he went on this rant while he was on the microphone and they decided to turn it into Oh no, <laughs> fucking like half a Handsome Jack's dialogue was just the fucking voice actor improv and yeah, that's Damon what Clark. makes him so fucking beautiful. <laughs> yeah, he just, like and... half of his fucking lines are just on the spot fucking shit that he made up and that's what makes it so goddamn funny. The guy who played Handsome Jack also played Cell in Dragon Ball Z. I'm not surprised. <laughs> Only someone who's worked for something like Dragon Ball Z could possibly pull off something like All that. Right, so, damn it. Either that or Ryan Reynolds. Hmm. Handsome Jack is basically the Deadpool of the Borderlands universe, which makes me sad because he's dead. Yeah. Well, Tales of Borderlands, Borderlands, didn't they have him come back? What? There was the Telltale uh, series stuff that they did. Tales from Borderlands? I don't know the details about it, but I know that the main character kind of struggled with uh, Handsome Jack kind of haunting him due to some kind of electronic recording. I never played Tales of the Borderlands. If you do this for me, I will give you enough money so that you can build a mansion out of other smaller mansions. <laughs> I didn't pay much attention to the Telltale games, mostly because when I'm told the choices I make in a game matter, and then they really, really don't, I get a little offended. I'd say they do better than, say, uh, Mass Effect 3. Ooh, spicy. But true. I bought Mass Effect 3 and never played it. Not missing much. Wow, you should have just returned it. Probably should have. I, I, it's just, I bought it before I started hearing some of the reviews, and I'm like, eh, I can try to do something with this, and then... You didn't. No, I didn't. <laughs> Red, blue, and green. The final boss is Marauder Shield. Oof. I'm pretty sure Bioware was just telling everybody to fuck off because they were out of ideas at that point. The final boss was Kyler Blindness. 
I'm a fucking bitch. <coughs> Your rockets are oh, yeah, absorbed since you by the... shiver brains evidently don't know how to listen, I'll say it again. Stop bringing in fake sirens. Only six sirens can exist in the universe at any, at any given time, and I already know of three. You're not going to convince me that you happen to find one of the remaining three just by doodling blue tattoos on some random chick's core. <laughs> I'll admit it was kind of funny. The first dozen times you idiots tried it, but now my office smells like marker fumes and dead people. So quit it! <laughs> I love you, handsome Jack. Why did they have to kill you? Uh, still gonna kill you, though. <laughs> Damn it. Also, that's interesting. Only six sirens. I'd never actually heard that before. I'm yeah. running things. Yeah. The first one was the, the fire one. The second one was the... the the purple lightning one, I think, that you get in uh, Borderlands 2. And uh, the third one... Lilith and Maya. Yeah, uh, but, the, but the third one was Handsome Jack's sister. Wait, he has a sister? And then also his daughter. How old is Moxie supposed to be in these games? Um, we don't ask these questions if we don't want to die. I mean... She somehow has a daughter, and yet she looks like she does. I mean, her entire character just screams, I get surgery on the daily. Probably. Yeah, and then you got that new one from Borderlands 3. The one that does the weird thing in the air, where she does a freaking somersault slant. Yeah, the I'd rather go for the spazers. <sighs> Oh yeah, the fucking the whole smash. I I'm not gonna lie. Looking at that, I was I was seriously considering playing Amaro over Zane, but I really want to play Zane. Hmm. Which one was Zane? He he's the fucking the operative. Oh, the operative. He has fucking gadgets and shit that he can throw out. It's pretty fun. Ah. Also, is that guy who kind of looks like a sniper the same guy yeah. who abducted those two characters from Tales of the Borderland? I don't think so. Hmm. I know Flack is probably going to be pretty interesting to play around because his thing is he's a fucking beast master, so he gets to fucking bring out his pets. So I'm like... How are they going to fucking do that? Because that's that seems like it'd be hard to do, but at the same time, it also looks really fucking fun. Hmm. I wonder who the DLC vault hunters for Borderlands 3 are going to be. I don't know. <sighs> We're talking missionary. <laughs> It'd be amazing if fucking for Borderlands 3, since like it's their big special one, that they just make it so you can play as every single one of them from all the past games with some kind of DLC. Ooh. Okay, you know That'd what? be some that would be fun. <laughs> that makes me very <laughs> erect. You're like, hey, you wanna play as Hollow Jack? Go for it. You wanna play as Death Trap? Yeah. Erectheon. What? Erectheon. Everyone from, everyone from Creed <laughs> to the fucking Technum. Wait a minute. Krieg would be kind of fun to play again. What was I doing? Oh, 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 oh no. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> Maxed out on my missiles. All right. There's got to be like, I don't know, one more to take care of. Let's see. One for 16 remaining, 15 remaining. <laughs> That face, dear God. Okay. 
I took care of those four. Which one have I not taken care of? Who died? Ah, uh, I see. Oh, Jesse died. Huh. Oh. Boo. Ow! Ow. Fudge. Damn it. Uh, got real quiet. Yeah. Wait, I was just over here. That's all nuts! That shit herded. That shit herded? What? You never was heard that, you that guys? one before? Was was that you guys that said there are the people I'm playing with? Ow, I guess. fucker. <sighs> oh yeah, we're only like a couple weeks away from E3. Oh boy. Hey, when are we gonna get fucking Pokemon Mystery Dungeon on the Switch? <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. You know what else would be pretty cool? Some fucking Metroid Prime 4 updates. That'd be pretty, pretty rad. Or at least anything about the Metroid Prime trilogy on the Switch. That too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching what? the fucking video Riley posted in the chat. <laughs> it's one of my you favorite scenes from the film. You haven't seen this movie? What movie? 22 Jump Street. 22 Jump Street. <laughs> oh. I saw that shit in theaters, man. I was dying. Then again, it was also written by Phil Lord and Chris Miller. Try around here. Okay, what? this is new territory, I believe. Down at the bottom should be uh, him. Not him, but a Metroid. A Gamma Metroid, I believe. Yep! Where are you? There you are. I think somebody did an SSF. Yeah, SFM animation of that clip with like Overwatch characters. <laughs> I remember that. <laughs> Damn it! Ugh. Get up there! Come on! How did he not blow himself <laughs> up? God damn! There we go. Now I got all the Metroids in Area Three. Place is now changing. Awesome. <laughs> 